Hi folks, it's Bart. It's Wednesday afternoon, the 11th of July, and I would like to introduce you to the Berea Arf Dog of the Week. This is Dexter. Dexter is, <laughs> as you can see, he's very affectionate, and he's an 18-month-old German Shepherd mix, and he's been with us about a month and a half, so a little longer than I would like, but he's just a real sweetheart. Uh, he weighs about 72 pounds, and uh, he's in, his adoption fee is $165. And uh, he came to us as a stray. Come here, bud. As you can see, he's pretty playful. And um, he's actually uh, about average energy level. And he's, uh, uh, he can be a little dog selective too. And um, he's also got a pretty pronounced prey drive too. So, uh, you know, if you're out with a walk, on a walk with uh, Dexter, don't be surprised if he goes after uh, a squirrel or whatever animal he sees. And he can also be a little dog selective. So. And also, uh, no cats. So if you've got cats at home, Dexter probably isn't going to be a good fit for you. But uh, he's a sweet boy. Dexter, come here. Come here, bud. Come here, bud. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Yes, he is. He's a very sweet boy. So uh, there you go. Um, now, if you're interested in Dexter, you do need to go through Rachel Papa. Uh, she's one of our volunteers here. And I will go ahead and I will post a number for Rachel at the end of this video. So if you have some questions about Dexter, you can give her a call. And... Uh, with Dexter, as with all dogs that we've uh, adopted out of Rhea Arf, uh, they've all been spayed or neutered. Uh, they've all received a microchip. They've received all their shots. They are dewormed. And then we also offer a seven day health guarantee. So if anything happens with Dexter in that first uh, week, uh, we'll take care of it. Uh, you don't need to see Dexter over there lifting his leg. Um, and then something else too about our shelter I may not have mentioned in previous videos. We are one of the largest no time limit shelters in the state of Ohio. Now, that's a little different than no kill, but we, we do euthanize if we have to. Um, and th those are very rare circumstances. It's usually under two scenarios. Uh, either one, a very bad injury that, uh, that uh, cannot be fixed or, or a terminal illness, or if it's a behavioral issue. And in most cases, 99 times out of 100, it's a dog who's been trained to bite. Um, and for those reasons, uh, we will euthanize, but it's very rare that we do that. Um, but uh, there you go, there's Dexter. So, uh, if you want to visit our website, it's BereaAnimalRescue.com. I'll post that website at the end of this video, and I'll also post a number for Rachel Papa. So, thank you for watching.